Hello, and welcome to a Thursday edition of Robert vs. the New York Times Crossword, best day of the week. Today we're going to do the Thursday, May 23rd, 2024 crosswords, and go for that 1546 day streak. So here's your spoiler alert for the Thursday mini. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. The mini is always free to play. All right, let's do it. Uh, star sobs. Row. Uh, radar. Oh man. Ride sonar. Word nerd. Word nerd. These cross references are tough, but word nerd seems appropriate for a crossword theme. Oh man, bride. Yep. Radar, spaceships tracker. You track spaceships with radar? I guess you do. They only track planes with radar. I don't know how they track spaceships. We have radar and sonar, actually. Didn't, didn't even mention that. Uh, Alright, anyway, not the main event. That's the Thursday Daily Grid, which is by Adam Wagner today. Here's your spoiler alert. If you'd like to play along, pause the video here, click on the link in the description below. Daily Grid does require a New York Times game subscription. Thursday's the best day of the week. It's the uh, the hard themed puzzle. Oftentimes there's a tricky theme. I see these shaded squares zigzagging in columns two and three. A bit maybe like DNA or something. Anyway, let's see what Adam Wagner has in store for us. Let's get into it. Many a download is an app, education group, academic achievements doesn't allow. Okay, Western Bloc since '93. NAFTA, rugby equivalent of a touchdown is a try. Member of an Australian mob is a roux. Strong desires are yens. Quirky bit of running footwear, some kind of shoe. The EU, is that what that is? Be like-minded about, agree on, gives a grilling. Sears maybe, flattering versus are odes. Island's hillside is a bray. Asian capital on the Mediterranean coast. Get over a breakup, say. Let's move on again two days in a row. Blank James, don't know it. A section of a kid's store. It's just toys. US region with the weather pattern officially known as Carl the Fog. Bay Area. What a king might sit on. Who said of himself in 1912, no one candidate was ever elected ex president by such a large majority. Taft. Ava DuVernay. Available as an apartment for rent. Brimming with. It's just teeming. This looks like it should be a move on. Nature centric channels, Nat Geo. Maybe we have to go. I see. Maybe for the across for the downs, we need to read them this way, like this. This is for rent, maybe. Maybe? This is, this is what I was thinking. I don't know what I'm doing. This is Mr. T. Oh. Yeah, I see. I think this is teeming, and we have ferment and toe ring. Okay, I get it. Releases let go. Two in a row. Where is it? British unit of mass is a ton. Paul. Forget. I'll remember probably ant. Target of a heist. Bank something. Dangerous thing to assume. Food brand with a rabbit mascot. One hawing but not hemming. Amazon Predator. Okay. Tiniest change and blank mar. Don't know it. A hairstyle worn by Janet Jackson. A with a hint to entering four pairs of answers in this puzzle. Um and don't come at a craps table. Our bets. This is the life and buffet dispensers. Maybe it's urns. Spanish grandmother is abuela. Cho chosen to do without. Next. Okay. Fidelity, bravery, integrity. I guess it's the FBI. Swindles and add evenly as a marinade. Uh, you can exploit iOS. Anagram of oral. Uh, Arlo. Swindles. 
fleeces, maybe? So that Cicely Tyson became the first black woman to host is SNL, subject for non-native speakers, ESL. Ropes in, cornerstone abbreviation, probably established. Fashionable look in lingo. A fit, lord it. Maybe it's sped. Food brand with a, another food brand with a rabbit mascot. Lays egg as a fish. Lay eggs as to spawn. Still I rise. We had that the other day also. Looks like it's frescoes, so it's going to be... Uh, I don't know. Please be our hero. Save us. Brush on. Ambassador's aid. Disney Lion voiced by Beyonce is Nala. It's an attache. Doesn't matter which is any. Chi Chi is artsy. This is lassos. Okay, popular brews are IPAs, in my opinion here. Maybe a laser show is light entertainment. The fate dispensers, maybe it's urns. Heart test initials. Could be EKG or ECG. Ends of a homemade walkie-talkie. Those will be tin cans entered like this. Next could be after, I guess. This is four goes, right? Or cone. Like a pine cone. Banana bread is often baked in a loaf pan. Uh, right, tin cans. Did I... No, four gone. Annie's? I see. Okay. Let's see what we can get. Maybe I should have gone for the downs. This is after. Concerning. Iconic declaration from Bruce Wayne. I'm Batman. Biota. Next. It's just then. This could be bank something. That's dangerous to assume risk. Two in a row. TLDR is too long, didn't read. Electrolytes contain ions. As for bank safe. Some kind of box braids. Tricks has a rat mascot. Tiniest change. Dimes, I see. The smallest coins, literally. Could be PTA or NEA. Hmm. This is degrees. And dog beds, that's kind of funny. And this is for bids. Like this. An ass, as in a donkey. A boa here, Beirut. Toshu, and it was PTA, PDF. King might sit on slats like the bed. And what is this? All. I guess I should just run the alphabet. Uh, what is it? I guess I could run the alphabet. Not sure that everything is correct though, because bows to an row. I see the British row. All right, so we've got a box braids theme with this Janet Jackson in poetic justice. A, uh, a reference I don't, I don't know. There it is. Romantic drama film starring Janet Jackson and Tupac. There are the box braids. We've got the uh, the dark squares, shaded squares, and the intersecting light squares actually be included here. What's nice, what's nice is that also there's no nonsense in the grid. If you just read straight down, you also get actual words, which are which are not clued, but uh, you know, since they have to be real words, it limits your options. So we've got degrees going like this. It doesn't allow is four bids going like this in the white squares, but we also have dog beds, which is fun, and fairies. And available is for rent. Priming is teeming. We also have ferment and tow ring. Doesn't do without is for gone. For bid, for gone. Ferment for cone. 
uh, tin cans here, and then we have Burkone and Tongans, people from Tonga. And then finally, Swindles, Fleeces. You brush on a marinade, not the strongest word ever, but frescoes and blue hen. Like the Delaware blue hens. Alright, that was somewhat fun to figure out. I do very much like that the grid has actual words in it. And these themers really affect every part of the grid, right? Box braids in the middle. These themers affect a lot of words here. Um, and it's nice that they're so regular in um, columns 2, 3, 13, and 14. Not super tricky, I don't think. 644 is still fairly slow, actually. But it's kind of a funny self-deprecating coat by Taft. A toe shoe, like Vibram's. I do see toe shoe and toe ring. But it's okay, we can move on. We had move on just the other day. Not clued like this, though. Clued as a movie or something, a song. Move on and agree on. That's an on dupe. Carl the Fog. <laughs> I vaguely knew that. So this is a King Mattress. Letter Man. Mr. T is a letter man. It's kind of funny. Paul Feig? Feig? This is rough. It's a bit rough, but... Crossing Nat Geo and Foes two in a row. Yeah, like hee-hawing, you know? I saw two clues meaning saying next, right? There's then and after. And then we also had two clues that matched somewhere else that I forget. Funny anagram on Arlo there. We have TLDR and in my opinion. Some modern initialisms. Oh, that's right, we had Still I Rise. That was the theme of the mini yesterday, two days ago. When I couldn't really uh recite it. That's right, we have two food brands with rabbit mascots. I think that's that's kind of funny. Kind of a funny um, clue echo. Personally, I don't like stuff like the EU, you know, but I get it. Never watched any Bachelor or Bachelorette in my life, but that is a guessable name anyway. I'm Batman is fun. Never played craps either, so plenty of stuff I didn't really know, but in the end I think that's a that's a pretty fun Thursday. N not a whoops, not super fast. And I saw Seth Puzzles do this, which is let's look at the stats for the puzzle first and then sync our stats so we can see a bit more data. So at the moment average is 933, 16% faster. And if we update our stats, then we drop the average by five seconds. So we we should be able to figure out how many people. But don't don't ask me to do it now. Uh, this is 24% slower than my average Thursday. So actually quite slow for me. I'm in this 13% of users, but. I guess this is playing pretty fast then. I guess it's playing pretty fast. Anyway, let's move on to some more puzzles, starting with the Telegraph plus word. Here's your spoiler alert for the plus word. There's a link in the description below. Plus word's free to play. It's a British mini crossword meets wordle at the end. Let's do it. Breed of cow is Angus. Completely lost. Could be at sea. The blank chef. Don't know it. Blanket with your life. Don't know it either. Tune. Anagram. No, I tune. Just unite. Guide a vehicle. Mock, jeer is to taunt. Do as Torval and Dean, that I don't know. Creepy, that I don't know either. Snake, one doing maths. Adder, okay. This is just steer. Naked chef. Uh, 
hurt it with your life. This is untie. There we go. All right. A lot of anagrams today. Our A has to go here, right? Krona? Like the currency. Fairly tough plus word, I'll say. Torval and Dean didn't know. I spelled Torval wrong, but British Ice Dancers. Didn't know that. I don't know my British Ice Dancers too well. Nice clue on Adder. And then we just have... Oh, that's right. This is a clue to anagram, but this is just an anagram. An anagram of iTune. Jamie Oliver is a celebrity British chef. I do know that. And then Krona, that's the plus word. But I guess quite a lot of information is given. The N has to go here. The A has to go here. The K can't go here, so it doesn't really make any sense here. So it's got to go here. That puts the R here. So it's actually not that tough of a plus word at the end. Anyway, so we want to telegraph code words. It's unfortunately not free to play. Hopefully you don't mind watching me play otherwise. And click on the links below. Try to find the E first. This looks as good a candidate as any, I would say. And this is also some kind of vowel. It's got to be the V, right? And this, this looks like index finger going across the middle, is what I'll say. That's got to help, right? This looks like gnocchi. Yum. This is north. Uh, Star of David. Tin foil. Mallet and emotive and such. Nervous. Where's our Q? Here's our Q. So here's Tucker and Knight. This is Zemeth. This looks like it might be Jim. This is Seppel. Empower. Elbow. Conjoin. All right. Fairly quick code words. Tough there. Seeing index finger was useful. It's quite useful. Let's try code words regular. Let's see if that's any faster or not. Cacao or cocoa, I guess. Gotta figure out which is more likely. And this looks like an E, right? I think it's more likely to be Coco. Nectar. This looks like an L. Eclair. That's good. Aquatic. Recruit. Okay. This looks like it might be Coward and Waltz, I would say. Uh, I don't know yet. This looks like it might be Crypt, though. What is it? Icy, but I guess it's ivy. Epic. Pickaxe. An awk is kind of bird. A craft. Uh, duteous. Interesting. This looks like it might be jester. Orbital. Umbridge. And pretty quick, but actually slower. Slower than the code word's tough today. So, uh, that was... It's pretty uh, satisfying to solve. Cow or Coco. The thing that pushed me over the edge was seeing this EA here. All right, EA is much more likely than EO. So, anyway, let's, uh, and as we always do on the New York Times Connections puzzle, we're trying to make four groups of four. It's hard yesterday. Let's see if it's any better. Got wheels and peels, bees and knees, shells, gossip, shoulders, ride. Head, whip, shucks, caffeine, auto, intercoms, toes, and pears. Okay, pears, peels, and shells, and shucks could be to remove the outer layer or something. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And then what's left? Gossip, intercoms, caffeine.
and bees. Right? These four, of course, slang for automobiles. Cars, I guess. What was left again? Gossip. Wait, no, Hedgehog's Nathan Toast. These four don't fit into removing the outer layer, head, shoulders, knees, and toes, or slang for a car. So what are these? Intercoms. Hmm. Maybe we should check the other ones first. This looks good, slang for car, right? Surprise, that's not blue, actually. Uh, shells, pears, shucks, and peels. Gotta be right, right? That's blue. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes must be yellow. Body parts and head, shoulders, knees, and toes, that's true. No Oxford comma, interesting. So what is what is this? Intercoms is weird. Please. This is a weird quartet of things. Bees knees. Secret life of bees. Honey bees. Spelling bees. Quilting bees. Intercoms. At least they're all slang words for gossip. No way. Gossip girl. I just don't see it. May not be worth trying to see it. I'm loath to give up this quickly though. Uh, intercoms. Some of the letters. Intercoms. Gossip. Caffeine. Bees. Bees. I don't think I see it. They're not anagrams with anything. Hold the caffeine, no. All right, let's just, let's go up on the purple. What do we got here? Buzzy things. Caffeine gives you a buzz, bees buzz. Intercoms buzz. And what's the buzz, you know? Tell me what's happening. All right, didn't figure out all four connections, but did, I mean, figured out them all by process of elimination, I guess. So uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll see you tomorrow for some Friday puzzles. See you then.